This is part two of my super caps video. Um, I'm going to give you a little bit more statistics here on the power that's coming in here. Uh, 125 volts and my regular amp meter I got on my first video if you've seen it. And the fan, I updated my little uh, diodes here and put a, a heat sink on it so it can better dispatch the heat because this really pulls it the current so I got the same capacitor 3000 farad 2.7 volt DC times 4 which gives me 12,000 farad and they're all hooked in parallel positive and then negative side and we're gonna see how long it takes to charge those all together at once and I'll give you a reading out of here on the displays here so you have your amps the current for the 3 volts DC then I'm going to show you the current on here, what it's drawing from the 125 volt AC input. And then this is the voltage rise on your caps once they start building up. And then you have your clock, timer clock. Alrighty, let's go ahead and start it up here. And got my switch here. And let's just watch the, the numbers here. We're at 122 amps starting off. Now it dropped down to 116 volt, and let's go ahead and see the other stuff in here. 60 hertz. Let's get back to the kilowatt hour. Okay, there's your wattage. It's 590 watts, and it drops as it continues to climb. As you can see, the current there dropping. Your voltage is going up on your caps. We're almost at 500 millivolt. And here is the actual VA, 118 volts. Okay, there's your amperage, 11.86 amps for your 124, 120 volt input. Caps are climbing pretty fast here. We're at one minute already. I'm almost at one volt. This just handles it just beautifully. It's really dishing out the current here. And these capacitors just stay cold to the touch. Like it doesn't even affect them. It just loves the current. See, we're at 1.1 volt already. 10 amps. It's dropping. Let's go back to the is your hertz. Frequency. Alrighty. Yay. 119 volt. That's actually climbs, goes up and down. 9.3 amps. Hertz. Let's go to the wattage here. Kilowatt hour, and there's your wattage. 411 watt for such amazing amp current going into this. And remember, the power company only charges you by the kilowatt hour. So, no matter how many amps or loads of current you're dumping in there at low voltage, you're just getting billed for the current, the uh, kilowatt hour which this is pretty low for the usage here. We're at 2 minutes 40 seconds, 1.6 volt. Charging very nicely. And 12,000 farad is an unbelievable amount of current in those caps slowly dissipated when you use something to draw off of which is my other video I will show you exactly what I'm going to use it for three minutes 20 seconds almost at 2 volt I'm going to stop at around 2.5 volt let's go to the amps now let's see Seven, still at seven amp. 
56 amp for the low voltage side, 3 volt DC. Point one volt at four minutes. Wires just a little lukewarm. Transformer's cold. But the wire's just a little lukewarm from all that current coming through. Staying around 50 amps on the low voltage side. Almost at five minutes at 2.4 volts. Yep, capacitors are cold to the touch. It's down to 5.7 amps. Alrighty, there's your 2.5 volt. Go ahead and stop it there. Turn everything off, and there you go. Took 5 minutes and 30 seconds to charge it up to 2.5 volts. 12,000 farad. Not bad at all. Alright, let me know your comments. Thanks for watching.